Kevin, it's great to have you here. How happy are you to have signed? Yeah, really happy. Um, I spoke to, spoke to Danny over the summer um, and he's shown his interest in me coming down to the club. Uh, it sounded good. Uh, I like what they're trying to do here. And um, yeah, I'm just glad to get over the line and, and get playing, get some get some football uh, under my belt this season. And the fans, of course, will know you quite well, but how, what position do you say you can play? Uh, so I'm a defender, centre back, um, left side, right side, centre half. Uh, but yeah, I'm a defender that likes to defend. Um, very good in both boxes, so I hope I can bring that uh, to the team um, and my level of experience at this level. Uh, played many games at this level, so I'm hopefully I can bring some leadership to this, to this team as well. You spoke about your experience at this level as well. Let's talk about that a little bit more. How will that help you going into the season ahead with Oldershot Town? Um, I think I've been in this, this league long enough to know what it takes to, to do well, uh, what a successful team looks like. Um, so I think that experience will come handy because it's quite a young team here. Um, I'm, I'm relatively young myself, but I've played a lot of games at this level, so hopefully I can bring that sort of maturity uh, and that knowledge to this team and try and help them push up and uh, to, to, to finish as high as we can this season. And of course, it's good to know some friendly faces. Obviously, you know Mitch from your time at Dover, but it must be good for you to have seen some faces you knew. Yeah, to be fair, a lot of the boys here I've played against, um, like Lewis, Kinsella, um, Alfred Witten, and all played against all these players before and obviously yeah played with Mitch Walker um, you know really good keeper really nice boy as well so um, makes it easier to settle into a new club when you um, when you know a couple of the boys there. Yeah. You mentioned the leadership skills earlier obviously you were captain at Dover for a little while do you think that's important do you think you'll bring that to the side here? Yeah I think it's just a natural part of myself as a, a human being and also as a player just to try and use my attributes and help people around me so I think my uh, my voice and my um, just my presence in general will hopefully rub off on a few of the boys here and uh, can maybe learn a bit from me and I can learn a lot from other people as well. So hopefully we can all um, better each other and, and you know, achieve some success this season. And of course, you've obviously impressed at this level because you've got a few England sea caps as well. You know, that's obviously going to be a good thing and positive for you and something you take forward with the club as well. Yes, yeah, it's, it's always good to sort of represent your country. It doesn't matter what level it's at. Um, so. That was a good honour for me and it just showed that, um, you know, during my time at non-league level, I've, I've done well and I can um, I can really impress at this level and, and help any club that I'm at. So hopefully I'll do the same with Aldershot. And let's talk about the manager's influence for a while. Obviously, I know he's been after you for a little while, so it's good to finally get it over the line. Yeah, so I um, had a chat with Danny a couple of seasons back. He's, he tried to get me down, but um, I had opportunity, opportunities in the, in the Football League, so I explored that. Um, and but now we've got it over the line. I'm here now, and um, it's, it's good to work under Danny now and, and Anwar because they've showed a lot of patience with me, and they've always wanted to get me down. And um, I've, I've always kept that in mind that if I do, you know, come back into the national league, that all short of being a club, I'd, I'd be willing to come to. Just finally, let's talk about your goals and targets for next season. Um, so personally, uh, I didn't play too much last season. So for me, it's about getting a good, a good um, amount of games under my belt, and to really, you know try and hit that 30, 40 game benchmark that I set for myself. Um, and in terms of club level, it's the goal is just to finish as high as we can do, really. Um, this league has shown to be unpredictable. Um, a lot a lot of dark horses, a lot of um, surprises, a lot of, you know, so I think um, it, it, whoever sort of can, can get that momentum at the start of the season and that sort of, uh, team cohesion and that, that togetherness, whoever has that, um, I think will do well. So hopefully that's us. Are you in with a shot? More information in the description below. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe. Oh.